Here we are with volunteers from the Natural History Museum and we're looking for wild British orchids. This project is part of a larger programme of research looking at how British wildlife is being affected by climate change. In the British Isles we have over 50 species of wild orchid. By us coming here, taking photographs of orchids, we can add this to our museum data set and hopefully build a picture through time over the last 180 years or so of whether British orchids are flowering at different times and what's causing it. Oh. Now, this is a species that you really have to hunt for. This is the bird's nest of orchid. And you can see that not all orchids are big and glamorous. This is one of the kind of quiet beauties of Britain's woodlands. And it has no chlorophyll. It's brown, has no green. And so, because it can't get sunlight energy, it actually has to get its food from the ground. One of the real concerns with climate change affecting wildlife is that if the insects that are associated with it emerge 10 days earlier or 10 days later, the relationship between those two groups of organisms is pulled apart. And this is a matter of major concern for everybody on the planet because if the ecology of wildlife is separated by climate change, this is also happening to our food security. Not all of Britain's orchids are doing very well at all, and this is one species that we're really quite worried about. This is the lesser butterfly orchid, and in southern England in particular, it's really suffering. Things like habitat management not being right, landscape change, pollution, all of these things are making life really tough for it, so we're really interested in records. Now, if you found an orchid, it's really quite simple what we'd like you to do to help this project. Take a photograph of the whole plant. Upload your image onto the website. Fill in the details on the recording scheme and bing, the data will come to us. This project is really important because it's a way for people to get involved with citizen science and just learn about the science of orchids and contribute to that. If we can understand how climate change is affecting orchids, we can take that knowledge and help us build into an understanding of how whole habitats like this are being affected by these changes. So orchids are really the springboard to really understanding how changes in the climate are affecting our wildlife. So get out there and get snapping.